The bull run momentum is gradually decreasing, the market cap is also decreasing. If you check the coin market cap now, you will notice some of these cryptos are down after pumping massively a few days ago. The price of the Jasmine coin has also decreased to about 5-6%. to The Jasmine investors seeing this price are now curious as they ask questions like, Nay, will Jasmine pump again? Do you have an opinion on the sudden decrease in the crypto space? In this video, we will be discussing all about this topic. Please note that I'm not a financial advisor. Anything I say about coins I talk about is based on my research and opinions. So when investing in any coin I recommend, kindly do a little more research to be on the safer side and do not forget to invest wisely. Without much saying, let's get into the discussion. Firstly, y'all know that the Christmas holiday is fast approaching, right? If you do the math, you will know that the crypto market is suddenly experiencing a downtrend due to investors selling their crypto portfolios to get things in preparation for the Christmas holiday. This, for sure, will reduce the momentum of market volatility, which is why I am not freaked out about the current state of the market. Everything will be good very soon when we get to 2024. Jasmine being an underdog with its longevity, I am anticipating Jasmine to explode to about 5 to 10x in 2024. Now let's dive deep into the full details of Jasmine Coin. Jasmine is an Intent of Things platform company on a mission to provide the infrastructure that allows anybody to use data safely and securely. This is to be achieved with the Jasmine platform created by the developers. In recent years, the valuable data generated from everyday life has been possessed by a small number of giant platformers in the global market. Jasmine Coin was launched in 2021 by Jasmine Incorporated, a corporation run by former Sony, NYSC, Sony executives and led by Chairman Ando Gwe, Sony's former president and chief operating officer. In theory, Jasmine promises to help end users monetize their personal data eventually. Users would upload their personal information to the Jasmine Personal Data Locker, PDL, in exchange for Jasmine tokens while enterprises pay service fees in those same tokens to access this data. Similar data licensing deals are already available to users on a far smaller scale. Jasmine aims to enlarge this pipeline by allowing users to add more data by connecting Internet of Things devices, making the data more valuable to buyers. Having a centralized location for clean data will also increase its value. The current century is sometimes called the century of data in which people, machines, and information are building new relationships. The developers strongly believe that Jasmine can help Japan take a leading role in creating such a world. Recently, there has been a growing concern regarding data protection. There seems to be a situation where personal data is excessively protected, so companies can find it more difficult to utilize and use the individual's data. The use of data in companies is dominated by vertically integrated systems, and there are many challenges to realizing data sharing across companies. With Jasmine services, solutions can be offered to these problems. The team believes that it is important to build a data ecosystem that creates a virtuous circle where both individuals and companies can benefit from the exchange of data. Personal data cannot be used due to various concerns. They also believe that the formation of this ecosystem will not only improve the situation but also contribute to reducing labor costs and expenses that companies are struggling to achieve. By using an effective reward system, Jasmi aims to create an environment where individuals participate based on their own will and companies will be able to create better products and services by making full use of the data. Also, Jasmi set out to form an expandable ecosystem. According to the white paper, Jasmi will attract and increase the number of end users for the platform by working with the member companies of the Jasmi initiative to develop new solutions while deploying its core services, SKC and SG. Through the applications on the Jasmi platform, companies can leverage blockchain to provide innovative solutions as well as reduce labor costs and server hosting fees. On the other hand, the users feel comfortable as they are assured about security while enjoying the company's services. Thus, the team envisions that the data lockers will spread widely across areas, ages, and genders by creating a system that benefits both companies and users. Finally, the team believes that an effective reward system is essential to building a healthy data ecosystem. 
just as personal data has been concentrated within centralized companies and these companies that use it are more and more dominating the world, the Jasmine team is now aware that personal data turns out to be the new oil of the digital age. The fact that the increase in utilizing personal data can generate huge profits clearly shows the value of this new resource. Therefore, there should be a fair economic environment in which companies that use this resource, which is data, pay each data producer a fair reward price. On the Jasmine platform, companies have to clearly show individuals the scope and purpose of how they will use personal data. They have to obtain permission and grant rewards in exchange for the data. As rewards with concrete value need to be offered, individuals will learn and recognize the value of their data through these rewards and, at the same time, will become increasingly motivated to share it with companies. As the value of these rewards is tied to both quantity and quality, data producers may have a better awareness of it when receiving higher rewards. The idea that personal data will be used in a democratic way will raise people's awareness of its value in a broader context. As a consequence, companies will also become more conscious of this ecosystem while collecting data and try to make further use of it. This is where the Jasmine token comes in. The Jasmine token is a custom token created on the Ethereum platform. It is based on the ERC-20 standard. Therefore, it enjoys the security and processing power of the Ethereum network. Jasmine has a total supply of 50 billion, with a circulating supply of over 48 billion Jasmine coins. Most cryptocurrency exchanges support ERC-20 tokens, making buying Jasmi relatively straightforward. Some of these exchanges include Binance, Coinbase Pro, Gate.io, KuCoin, DigiPhoenix. Investors can also use Uniswap and other Ethereum-based decentralized exchanges to trade Jasmi tokens. For most investors, Coinbase Pro is the logical choice. The exchange is available in the US and the platform has the second highest liquidity among its peers. 24-hour values traded can exceed $20 million. On the other hand, those residing outside the US should favor Binance, an exchange that can see over $100 million per day in JASME transactions. Binance also allows staking, which can help investors boost their returns by up to 6% annually. Opening an account with Binance or Coinbase involves visiting their respective sites, showing identification, and following their website-specific instructions. Meanwhile, investors using Uniswap or another DeFi exchange can use Metamask or another reputable wallet to connect. This will be the end of the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and invest wisely. Thanks!